Hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog. I realized that I just kind of be jumping on these videos and getting straight to it. I know I said this before, but I'm gonna do a better job. So hi, my name is Paige and I share everything from experiences to lifestyle, to food, to travel, to music, things to do, you name it, you got it. That's what I post. And if you like any of that, please make sure that you do subscribe because I would love you guys to not miss a video. Like, hello, I'm trying to be consistent here. Anyways, today is Thursday, February 29th. And what better way to come on here to show y'all how I'm spending leap year. I think I'm gonna make this a weekend vlog because my brother is coming into town tomorrow. And then I just have stuff to do this weekend. So I feel like this is the perfect opportunity to get back into the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed Tulum. Tulum was so much fun. All we did was party. No excursions, just party. <laughs> I wish we would have done some excursions, but that just gives me room to go back to Tulum. Girl math, right? Right now, I'm about to go to this Leap Year event. Let me... Pull up the details before I lie to you guys because I don't want to lie. So it's a leap year event at Hotel Vesper Houston. I think they just re... It's a Marriott hotel that they just renovated. And basically there's going to be dinner, cocktails, um, and an after dinner experience. I don't know exactly what that means. And then they offered me an overnight stay. I don't know if I'm going to stay because that's not too far for me, but... I don't know. So we're gonna go to that. I am gonna wear my hair in the side part. I haven't been wearing my hair in the side part at all, but I think she's kinda cute. Now, let me show y'all what I'm gonna be wearing, cause, but I do need to put some lotion on, so hold on. Um, This navy blue top that I got from, I'm pretty sure Zara, cause I get a lot of my basic tops from there. This bangle is also from Zara. It's super cute, y'all. Like, I can't believe bangles are back in, but I'm here for it. So I'm definitely going to up my bangles collection. They just add a little bit more to your outfit, as you can tell. Um, I have on these black leather pants because for some reason, y'all, on Monday it was 90 degrees and then it just got right back cold. So I'm like, please make up your mind. I just have on these leather pants that they are stacked at the bottom. And then I have on these Am I ashy? I think I'm ashy, but these are like little heels. I'll show y'all actually, because I really, really, really like these, but it's like a um, a dripped effect. I don't know if you can really pick that up on the camera, but yeah, I really like them. They're super comfortable. Um, it's like um, kind of like memory foam in the shoe. So yeah, I don't know, like I said, if I'm going to stay at the hotel because it's something about just being in your own bed and plus i've been traveling a lot recently so i kind of just want to exist in my own space you know and my brother's coming to town i just got stuff to do i just got stuff to do so what i'm about to do now i'm about to put some lotion on my feet because they are giving a little ashy and then we're going to head on over let me see how far it is i didn't even think about that Ooh, my makeup it's pretty simple for the most part I went back to using some Foscaras. I do like the Foscaras, but like sometimes they give lash, sometimes they don't like the individual lash, but you could stack them more. So I guess maybe I will stack them more. Girl, I don't know. It's too much. I'm just a girl. Whoa. So this started at five and it's already 510. So, okay, well. Um, but anyways, I'm about to head out. I'm going to wear my silver purse and it's going to be some other foodies there. So I'm pretty sure it'll be pretty fun. So yeah, I will check back in with y'all in a minute. Hey, 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 hey,
child. <laughs> so, Ladies, don't be like that. Paige, please, Sorry. you're the main one. Wait, 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 wait. During your stay, you'll receive complimentary breakfast for two and complimentary parking. It's a thank you card. And it says, Dear Paige, thank you for joining us as we celebrate Leap Year. Please enjoy your time with us. And we appreciate your support. Share this exciting experience with your followers. Welcome to Hotel Vesper. Oh my gosh, guys. They freaking love us. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. So this looks like two macaroons, a strawberry, and I don't know what that is in that little jar. I don't know what that is. But anyways, I'm probably about to wind down. No, actually, I'm about to go mess with Tiana. She's in the other room. I'm about to go mess with her real quick, so. All right, y'all, let's unwind for the night at Hotel Vesper, so. Ooh, baby, I'm tired, okay? I am drained. It's almost like 2 a.m. in the morning. Girl, you know it's past your last time. You need to go to bed. Took my stuff to the car. Now I'm about to eat breakfast. Y'all, the calf is so cute. Like, this place is so cute. They remodeled this um, hotel. I don't know what it used to be, but what it is now is so cute. Like, bomb. And my false scares was falling all out. Like, <laughs> I was sleep that good, y'all. Like, the sleep, immaculate. Immaculate. Right now, I'm waiting on T to come downstairs so we can eat breakfast and then I'm gonna go home because uh, I need to clean up and stuff and I have Pilates at 11.30. But, and then my brother comes into town. It's just a lot, like, girl. I'm about to wait on tea to eat breakfast and then, yeah, I'll check back in with y'all once we eat. We're at breakfast. Oh, it's been a long while. You got a caramel macchiato? I need some. I'm leaving here with some. Food has arrived. It has arrived. It has arrived. Extend your arms and move your arms. From your shoulders, not from your elbows. Just walk this time. Three, four. Lift your chest. Up, up, up. Moving your carriage. Then go down with your chest. And bend your 
elbows again. Let's do this again, two more times. Ah, big, big, big swan, beautiful swan. Don't keep your carriage, control the carriage. And last one, push, go up, move your carriage to the front, up, 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 and then go down. And two. Hey guys, it's a little bit later. I went to Pilates, y'all seen that already, I'm sure. My brother and my sis is here. And Kaylin is already getting on my nerves, but you gotta love them. Actually, we're about to get dressed to go to Seven. Have y'all been to Seven? I'm excited. I've never been to Seven. I feel like Seven is like Seal. And Seal was actually pretty good. If Seven is anything like Seal, I will be impressed. And I hope that they're doing a show tonight. I just decided on what I'm going to wear. I think I'm going to wear like this bodysuit with these black um, kind of leather pants. I may wear my leather boots, but they'll kind of be hurting a little bit sometimes. I don't know yet. I'm trying to decide. Pictures will be taken. Video will be shot. Blog will be happening. So stay tuned. All right. All right. Just got dressed. It's like it's cold outside, but it's not. I feel like this jacket is kind of overdoing it, but let me show y'all what I'm wearing. Back with another bubble bubble banger. So I got on this bodysuit. Um, I think I got it from Zara. I don't know where I got these pants from. And then laced up heels, um, earrings, nose ring, bangles, because we're bringing them back. And I'm going to take my edge wrap off later because the edges got a simmer sim simmer sim simmer Ari what are you wearing today look y'all we love the cramps we love the cramps we love the lip it's it's giving character it's giving I love it here we were gonna uber but y'all for real it was $40 one way uber got the city in a chokehold okay I'll check in with y'all once we get back I mean get to Seven, because I'm going to bring it away to me. Okay? Okay. Kabish, kabish. Hi. So we made it to seven. Um, me and Ariana are going to do some TikToks. Y'all say, hey, what's up to our girl? We're at seven. Let me show y'all, y'all, because it's super nice here. We just ordered some cocktails, but it's super nice. And then they have a patio. Y'all know patio season coming up. Don't act funny. They revamped their entire menu, allegedly. And I'm gonna let y'all know. I'm, I'm gonna be on my keep lead tonight. For cocktails, Ariana got the Gris. It has reposado, that sounds so good. That's, that's if I had a drink, that would be me. I got Envy, it has gin, and like cucumber and melon. So a fresh little drink, drinky drink, you know? And once our food and appetizers come out, we did order the arancini and some oysters for starters, so. Keep y'all posted. All right, drinks are here. That's greedy. Greedy looks cute. And then whatever I got. I don't even know what I got, but it looks good. So now you gotta do what you said. Ooh, this is nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like roaches in here or nothing. All right, appetizers are here. We got some oysters and we got some arancini. You like your drink? Yay or nay? Yes. I haven't even tried mine actually. Let me try my drink and I'm gonna let y'all know. I'm gonna rate it one through ten. <laughs> oh, it's still good. You wanna try it? Be, uh, it's gonna be closer to like a cucumber martini. Yeah. Um, it's gonna be a gin based drink. I feel like gin mixes well. Yeah, it does. Support. It's really I don't good. Even like, like cucumber, like really? I love cucumber. It's good. It's very fresh. Yeah, yeah, no, that's really good. How do you feel about your cocktail? I love it. It's good. good. Yeah. Okay, you guys enjoy. Thank, All right, thank you. you. Okay. All right, so we're about to try the appetizers. You already took pictures. Take what you need. Yeah. I'm gonna try first. We're trying to. Okay, that was go good. ahead. 
I can work with that. Also, the oysters, they were really good. I've had better, but they were actually really good. They are smaller, but we gave them a nine. And then for the arancini, we gave that, I gave it an eight, Ariana gave it an eight point five, but those are really, really, really good. I think with some cheese on the inside, chef's kiss, it would have been bomb. Um, all right, foods here. I already got the ribeye. That looks good, what's that sauce? It looks like gravy. Oh. Look at this sea bass, oh my gosh. I'm back with another bu -bu 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 banger. Oh, that's your intro. Okay, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Hey, y'all, back again with another bu -bu 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 banger. Today, today, today. Make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. So, let's go. Come on, let's go. We're at Snooze, guys. This is Kaylin and Ariana's first time at Snooze. Everybody ordered something different. So I'm excited for them. Ariana doesn't like her lattes. So snooze, do better, okay? When I'm inviting guests, I need you to be on your best behavior. You know we have to double it. We're at La La La. The air is getting thicker. I can't help but stare at you. You see how the red is on the background? So now I'm gonna get right here. <laughs> now what do I do? You just taking a video of me. We're at La La Land. Um, Aubrey is my camera person for the day. Come on, let's go. So if you see here, I'm on vacation with Aubrey. Aubrey, you wanna tell them you're gonna be um, behind the camera today? Say what's up. Hi. So Aubrey's gonna be behind the camera today. She's filming, so I'm gonna let you film us, okay? All right, y'all, it's a little bit later. We're back with another b -b 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 banger. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Girl, you, you need to drink shit. <laughs> <laughs> you see, she jacked up already. He ain't went nowhere. All right. But yeah, I'm not bringing my camera, but I'll vlog off my phone as always. Give me this stuff. As always. But yeah. So we got the rent. Two of the baddies in. All right, tell us what you're wearing real quick, real quick, uh, real quick. Uh, I mean, to be just honest. Just show us the fit. Just show us the fit. Target. It just yes. some Fashion light. Nova. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. well, she going Target Fashion Nova. I'm going Levi Stowe. Nike stove, yeah. Levi stove, yeah. And full locker. All right, all right, all right, all right. You look cute in your target. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> be so for real. All right, come on. This is my 10 shot. Boy, <laughs> Kevin, why you put your lips on my stuff? Bro, that's so disgusting. I know how I See, mama. See, mama, this is how your son really acts. See y'all later. Bye. Oh, guys, I just realized I didn't vlog anything at ghost bar boo i suck bad vlogger bad vlogger why can i do weekly vlogs but i can't do weekend vlogs like what's that about um my brother and sister-in-law they have they left um they went to my niece's soccer game and then they're gonna head home to dallas so i just had some work to catch up on and i wanted to watch my church sermon y'all church today i think i missed the last two weeks of church um just due to traveling and just not being intentional like i'm not gonna make no excuses like honestly just not being intentional i something today was like prompting me to okay i'm not physically at church but Paige, you can still tune into church like i don't know how i forgot about that it's on youtube like i can also watch um watch my church live so i just turned it on and i sat down got my bible got my um Got my notebook ready and got my notebook ready and put my phone on do not disturb. Y'all, when I said the message was so good, on time, like when they say he's the on time God, yes he is. Yeah, 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 he is because I swear this message was for me. Literally this morning I kept telling my brother and sister, I was like, man, like I'm tired, like I'm 
I'm beat. Like, I'm worn. I got all this stuff to do. Da, 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 da. So today's message was over burnout. And he referenced the verse Matthew 11, 28 through 30. He was saying, Pastor Flowers was saying in the message, he was saying, like, a lot of times when people go to church, like, yeah, the pastor makes them aware of their problem, but does not give them the tools and resources to address those problems in our lives, right? And I'm going to do my hair and stuff. I already did my makeup while well, I tell y'all this. Sorry. Um, so I just feel like it was right on brand because I'm like, am I experiencing burnout? So he talked about the different levels to burnout and like there's like level one, level two, and level three. And I'm going to read some of the stuff that I have on my notes while I do my hair. Time can equate to life, right? When you waste time, you're wasting your life because time is one of the things that we simply just do not get back. Like once it's gone, baby, it's gone. He was just saying that, you know, so we need to be intentional on how we spend our time. When the same old distractions and we get over like the distractions and the obstacles that the devil has put in our way, he tries to find different ways to attack us, essentially, like find different ways to wear us out and that's where burnout comes into play that's something that a lot of us have faced especially in you know this society of oh i'm booked and busy when we're tired we think sometimes we're physically tired but really it's our soul tired like our soul is tired and a nap does not fix anything and honestly y'all that was for me because one thing about it any inconvenience I'm like, I'm just gonna take a nap. That's only, it's only can be a temporary fix. Like it's not a permanent fix. And I was like, okay, okay. And in Matthew 11, 28, and I don't have the exact verse um, word for word, but it just talks about how we can go to God and for that rest. So like God is the one that provides us that rest. He provides us that comfort. He provides us that peace. And I was like, oh, speak to me. Like God is so intentional that he gave us the resources before we even knew that we would need them. Is that not crazy? I think that's crazy. Like, how intentional do you have to be? You no, know, I just think it's crazy that God's that intentional. Like, I knew God is intentional, but when you when things start to click in your own head, it's it's in game. It's in game. Something that really stuck out to me. Um, one of the verses that really stuck out to me was that. Well, it wasn't a verse. It was something he said. Pastor Flowers said, "Value spiritual nourishment over external flourishing." And he was saying that when you're intentional with your spiritual growth, it will never be an expense. So be intentional because anytime you focus on your spiritual growth, you're spending time with God. So you're going to get those fruits of being comforted, being peaceful, being restful, like being rejuvenated. You get that from God. You get clarity and peace from God. And I was like, it makes so much sense. And he was just saying, you don't, you can't operate on fumes like how do you expect to live out your purpose on this earth and you always tired because you haven't addressed you being tired that nap is not addressing you being tired i'm like oh my gosh like i'm just sitting on the couch like i should have went to church like i should have physically got up and i was like but i'm here i'm here i'm here we're gonna focus on the good thing but he's saying when you get to that level three of burnout there ain't no no vacation can fix that. No bag, no watch, no shopping spree, no target run can fix that. Like, why are you yelling at me? Like, I swear this message had my name on it. Hopefully, maybe, maybe I get to share this to inspire one of y'all to go like listen to the the sermon because y'all, it was really, really good. Like, it was bomb. It was bomb for sure. It was bomb. Now, I think this is this is good. I'm wearing my hair in the side part. I normally would put the conditioner in the spray bottle, but I just realized I didn't. I forgot. I was too excited about the word that I got today. <laughs> I'm getting ready to do this food collab with one of my foodie friends. Her name is Erin. Y'all go follow her. I think her Instagram name is Greedy Girl Guy. Greedy Girls Guy. Greedy Girls Guy. Yeah, it's Greedy Girls Guy. We're doing a collab. And I don't want to give y'all the details of her collab because this is her content and I'm just being a part of her content. So I don't want to spoil her content, if that makes sense. This is Sunday, March 3rd. Let's see. It's my birthday month, you guys. I'm so excited. Uh, I have 203. Oh my gosh. Yo, that is dope. Okay. See, when I see stuff like that, it gives me just another win, y'all. I love that. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I'm about to get dressed, lay down my edges, and then head over to where Erin is. 
And then I'm going to bring y'all with me because I think it would be really fun just to include this into my weekend vlog. But yeah, thanks guys for being here. I'm so, I'm so grateful. Like, Anyways, I'll check back in with y'all in a minute, okay? So I just got back home. Let me wash my hands. Hold on. All right, y'all. So I just got back. Y'all saw a little bit of me and Aaron just hanging out, vibing. I really wanted to. Y'all probably caught like glimpse of like what we're doing, but I'm just gonna save it for whenever she posts it. I just wanted to include that because like this is a weekend vlog. All right, so it's nine. I'm really trying to be in the bed by like 10. So let's get unready. I just wanna relax. I'm not tired, tired to where I'm like, I'm sleepy, but I'm tired to the point where I just wanna kinda relax and wind down for the night. So I guess we'll get Unready? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. 